Hello friends, today we will see about Taylor's approach of spinal anesthesia by myself. Mark if the patient in lateral position, mark your landmarks. The posterior superior iliac spine, one needle entry is 1 cm cardo medial to enter into the L5 S1 ethical space. As you see here, the patient is in lateral position, parts being painted and draped. So you use beta den uh, spirit and then your dry gas. You can see here the patient is not flexed too much as you see here the legs are extended, just lying comfortable in the lateral position. Then you can see the needle entry point there. Needle entry point is there. 1 cm medial and corded to the posterior superior iliac spine. So, I have not edited my video. So, let's see how it goes. So, I am going in a cephalo medial direction. So, still it hits the bone that is either will be the sacrum and walk medially again a bone. Or further medially again bone and now it's cephalo direction again bone now you add cephalo medial direction you will enter into the thickle space with the pop and you can see this so these today I had a hectic uh, spinal with 3 to, to 7 attempt with the patient in sitting position in the, uh, I tried in the midline it's very difficult to find the thick interlaminar space finally I went for paramedian technique by God's grace I got my uh, successful spinal anesthesia in case of ankle and spinal anesthesia you can do this technique where it's difficult to flex them uh, a difficult to flex the legs, you can try this. Maybe it will be successful. LPS1 is a big lamp, lamp space. Thank you. Thank you.